Summers. Does it ring a bell? Summers, as a child I once longed for, is now a solstice I rejoice in no more. Remember I those youthful years, I would ramble into the wild along the rivers, feared neither snake or the wild boar, nor the sun shining on my head sore. With an empty head and an open heart, I would scurry the hills, climb the trees, conquer rivers and fight the stream. For I was bound to explore and explore. But oh, now I loathe the scorching sun. Think of whereabouts to have a little fun. Life has changed and so have my priorities. Can't be dreaming of playing the salt trees. Yes, life was fun without responsibilities. Dawn to dusk, laughed and played. At evenings, the starry skies I gazed. Listened to stories from mom and dad, not bored even if they often repeated. And answered they gladly the same questions I daily repeated. Every day's routine brought nothing, simply happiness of a village urchin. And concerning the mundane matters, oh, how does it even matter? Understood nothing of the humdrums, enjoyed daily toast, bread and crumbs. But now I think of various possibilities, sit for hours dealing with life reality. At crossroads I would consider to ponder how I would place certain things to order, without which life would be dull and days be empty, void and null. Home and work, to and fro, is all I know. But summers? I don't know where to go. Can't bear the heat. Bodies become weak. Rainy days and winters are still better. Summers only get hotter and hotter. Oh, the sweltering summer sun. And guess I am not the only person on earth a story to tell. Does this ring a bell? Thank you for watching guys. This was a short poem on my, my opinion about summers. If you liked it, please do share, subscribe. And if you can relate to it, yes, definitely please do subscribe. And please don't forget to hit the bell icon for notifications on more of my write-ups coming up shortly. Thank you. God bless.